El Magazi Learning Consulting LLC presents workshop series on the cotton book, from the field to the retailer. The workshops cover all aspects of the textile supply chain. From the field to the gin. From the gin to the spinning mill. From the spinning mill to the knitting and weaving mill. And ultimately to the retailer at the end of the supply chain. The speaker of this workshop is Dr. Yeya El Magazi who is a worldwide known expert in the field since 1981. In recent years, Dr. El Magazi and his group have visited many companies around the world providing consulting services in different segments in the textile supply chain. These include companies in Vietnam, Bangladesh, Indonesia, Egypt, Thailand, USA, Azerbaijan, Pakistan, and Turkey. Dr. El Magazi also wrote three books in the field and produced many video sessions on different subjects in the spinning, weaving, and knitting processes. His company is also well known in solving textile quality disputes through testing and diagnostic analysis of causes and effects of yarn and fabric quality problems. The workshops consist of many sessions that can be customized per the company needs and interests of the subjects. Examples of these sessions are as follows. Session 1, Cotton Marketing and Pricing System. This session represents a full day covering the following subjects. 1. Cotton Buying Practices Around the World. 2. Cotton Pricing Systems. 3. The Code Luque Index. 4. New York Nearby Price. 5. Spot Price. 6. Ways to Predict Cotton Price. Session 2, Worldwide Cotton Marketing 1. How different cotton producing countries are performing in the marketplace 2. Ways to predict cotton performance in a given market 3. Effect of trade regulations 4. Production, yield and harvested land 5. Export 6. Import 7. Domestic use 8. Stock to use ratio Session 3, An Overview of Key Cotton Fiber Properties Fiber Length, Staple Fiber Length, Upper Half Mean Length, Uniformity Index, Short Fiber Content Micron Air, Is It Fineness or Maturity Fiber Strength and Fiber Elongation Color Parameters are D and Plus B Trash Content NEPS Session 4, How to Deal with Different Sources of Cotton Fiber Contamination Session 5, An Overview of Key Cotton Yarn Properties 1. Yarn Count 2. Yarn Strength 3. Yarn Irregularity 4. Imperfections 5. Hairiness 6. Yarn Density and Shape Factor 7. How to Interpret Classomat Data and Yarn Body Profile 8. Comparison of Yarn Qualities Produced by Different Spinning System Session 6, Comparison Between Different Cottons Around the World Upland Cottons, US Cotton, Indian Cotton, Turkish Cotton, West African Cotton, etc. ELS Cottons, Egyptian Cotton vs. Sukuma Cotton Is blending cotton of different origins a serious task? How you make an optimum cost and quality when blending cottons of different origins? Session 7, Cotton Fiber Sustainability What is sustainability? 
is sustainability a promotional tool or a corporate culture? The Better Cotton Initiative BCI. U.S. Cotton Trust Protocol Organic Cotton Cotton Fiber Sustainability The Integrated Concept from the Field to the Retailer Session 8, The Difference Between Cotton Market Value and Cotton Technological Value What are the differences between the market value and the technological value of cotton? Would cheap low-quality cotton reduce your cost? Would expensive high-quality cotton guarantee your profit? What is the ultimate cost trade-off? Session 9, Cotton Production, From Harvesting to Janing What is the difference between hand-picked and mechanical harvesting? What are the key attributes of manually picked and mechanically harvested cottons? What are the difference between spindle harvested cotton and stripper harvested cotton? Session 10, Cotton Ginning What is the difference between roller ginned and saw ginned cottons? The effect of drying on cotton The effect of seed cotton cleaning The effect of lint cleaning Differences in trash content Differences in short fiber content Differences in neps Differences in contamination Which cotton is better for your process? Hand picked or mechanically picked? Spindle picked or stripper picked? What is the impact of cotton contamination? Session 11, Cotton Bale Management Cotton Bale Management from the arrival of cotton to the bale laydown How to minimize the cost of fiber testing and bale management What can you do with the massive fiber and yarn data you collect every day? What is the best way to manage cotton bales from the arrival to the bale laydown? What is an ideal bale warehouse, indoor or outdoor? What is an ideal bale warehouse arrangement? Session 12, Cotton Fiber Selection Part 1 Different Methods of Cotton Fiber Selection By Bale and By Group and Category Fiber Selection What is the difference in cost and quality between By Bale and By Category Cotton Fiber Selection? What are the critical fiber properties to consider in fiber selection? How to deal with poor quality cotton bales? How to handle reusable fiber waste? Session 13, Cotton Fiber Selection Part 2 Cotton Fiber Selection with Respect to Spinning What cotton attributes are suitable for ring and compact spinning? What cotton attributes are suitable for open-end spinning? What cotton attributes are suitable for air jet spinning?
Session 14, Cotton Fiber Selection, Part 3 Cotton Fiber Selection with Respect to Yarn and Fabric Quality What cotton attributes are suitable for coarse to medium yarn counts? What cotton attributes are suitable for fine to very fine yarns? What cotton attributes are suitable for strong yarns? What cotton attributes are suitable for low hairiness yarns? What cotton attributes are suitable for low imperfection yarns? What cotton attributes are suitable for knit fabrics? What cotton attributes are suitable for woven fabrics? Session 15, Cotton Fiber Blending Cotton Fiber Blending, Between Art and Science Why Cotton Blending? What are the consequences of blending cottons of different origins? What is cotton blending by weight? What is cotton blending by color? What are the do's and don'ts of cotton blending? How does cotton blending influence your yarn and fabric quality? The cost slash quality formula of cotton fiber blending how to minimize the cost of cotton fiber blending How cotton blending affect your cotton purchasing strategy Session 16, Cotton Fiber Machine Interaction Part 1 The Effect of Processing on Cotton Fiber Quality Opening and Cleaning Carding Drawing Combing Roving Session 17, Cotton Fiber Machine Interaction Part 2 The Spinning Process Different Yarn Types Ring and Compact Spinning Open End Spinning Air Jet Spinning Session 18 Cotton Fiber Machine Interaction Part 3 Fiber Waste Analysis and Yarn Realization How to Minimize Fiber Waste How to Reduce Comern Oil The Contribution of Cotton Fiber to Fabric Quality Fabric Strength Fabric Comfort Fabric Bar Fabric Twisting Fabric Defects Session 19, More on Fiber Machine Interaction Session 20, an open session for questions and answers. The Cotton Book, From the Field to the Retailer. Companies interested in these workshops or customized workshops can contact Mr. Mike Lazano, the sales director of El Magazi Learning Consulting, or they may directly contact Dr. El Magazi. The Cotton Book, From the Field to the Retailer. The only comprehensive coverage of cotton fibers throughout the entire textile supply chain.